I know I look mad, mad ghetto right now. <laughs> it's not even a shower cap, but I am too lazy to go to the store and get some more shower caps. All of mine like wore out. Um, and I am not naked. I have on a towel. I just got fresh out the shower. Um, it's crazy because all that work I did with Jillian, um, Jillian Michaels, that DVD, like it's a lot of legs and jumping and um, jumping jacks and all kinds of stuff. And guess what is kind of sore today? My shoulders. Look, it doesn't make any sense. I guess all the stabilizing or whatever, I don't know. So, whatever. It's a beautiful day. Um, it's a little cooler today, but the sun is shining and it's nice outside and yeah, and the birds are chirping, like literally outside our window. <laughs> they do that like every morning. But um, I'm excited because um, I know you probably saw some of the junk yesterday on the table because we had to clear out all of our stuff. Um, and I'm gonna get some of that stuff in the sink and like work down the counter and stove because we're getting our kitchen renovated. Um, <laughs> so we're gonna get like, I, I saw what we we're gonna get, but we're gonna get like a nice backsplash and um, some uh, like a, a microwave in there and like some more stuff. <clears throat> So hopefully they come today because they were supposed to come yesterday and no, they didn't come. I don't know why. And then my neighbors, like literally beside me or all the, like around us, they got theirs done today and we didn't get ours done. It's like they're treating us like we didn't pay rent, but I know we did. Um, so it's all our stuff from the kitchen on the dining room table. Um, yeah. So I'm gonna get beautified, ready, and yeah. I'm back, guys. Um, I am starving, like Marvin, like really. Um, <laughs> and I'm a little bored with the um, potatoes and egg whites that I've been eating for breakfast. So um, I'm gonna eat some Ezekiel bread. Um, if you don't know, this is sprouted grains. Um, and they're like whole grain, organic, and if I can show you, probably can't, but on the ingredient list, it's just like literally what you see in the front, and usually that doesn't happen, but just grains and like probably some egg to bind it and just anything organic, and I'm going to put a little bit of the, the, this um, apple butter spread on it, and I got it from the... Um, international market that I was telling you guys about um, I'm really surprised at the ingredient list on this though um, if you can see that all it is is apples and apple cider um, and it's 40 no 20 calories <laughs> 20 calories a tablespoon so I'm probably gonna put a couple tablespoons on a little bit of toast and um, be on my way Off to work. <laughs> Wrong part, shit. You remind me. Obviously, he's not the singer in the relationship. <laughs> um, speaking of singing, if you want to check me out, um, <laughs> I have the singing page too. Uh, Ebony sings for you. But, um, I wanted to talk about um, last night's workout. Um, after I stopped recording, like, I, I probably never in my life had that kind of like wooziness and you, you remind, sorry, I love this one. <laughs> anyway, I've never had that kind of wooziness and like dizziness. Um, after working out in my life and <laughs> I googled um, and researched like causes of dizziness after you work out and come to find out I 
I didn't eat um, or uh, basically carb up <laughs> before I started working out. Um, also, you notice I was like not here for the cool down. Like I just was not feeling it. Uh, but it's important to cool down and um, kind of slowly bring your body down after a workout that intense. Um, so as much as it's, you know, something I don't want to do, I'm going to have to um, cool down. Um, you remind I had kind of like a dessert last night because uh, I had like way too many Come on, let's make this light, Jeff. calories um, left over. Damn! Whoa. Your man hit the car That is nasty. Jeff. That's really nasty. Well, That's, how do you hit the we crosswalk sand? We always have the accident sand, in this area. Well, how do you hit the crosswalk sand, man? Yeah, I don't know. What? But yeah. Um, I don't know if you guys know about <laughs> Hungry Girl or uh, Lisa Lillian. Um, she's really big on calories and reducing calories and eating the most for your calories and everything. So, um, I tried one of her like kind of healthier um, recipes, and it was like a um, she call it she calls it dessert island parfait, and um, it's basically like a low fat vanilla yogurt. I used um, light uh, Greek yogurt for it, and some pineapple. Oh no, not pineapple, mango, and um, bananas. And it was pretty good, pretty filling too. Um, but I was like trying to fit in the rest of my calories, um, for the day, like all in one sweep, so, thank you, Lisa Lillian. Um, I'll, I'll have to insert, like, um, just like when I chopped up my, uh, fruits and stuff, um, or like kind of really looked at the fruits, um, our apples started to like, um, like turn and stuff and you know that we just went to the pool. yeah we just got them like we just um i'll insert a picture it hasn't even been a week or it, we got them sunday and it's wednesday now but they expired like i don't know for like really really quick so I feel like um, we believe that cooperation the apples may be organic. Um, that's what I'm saying about a lot of the produce that we get from that like international market. Um, they they go bad really quickly. Um, so it's hard to believe there's any kinds of preservatives or pesticides or anything on it. Um, so I can't imagine that anything that does have it on it would turn that quickly. I know apples that last for months and months. I'm a little upset, but at the same time, at least I know I'm eating something without, you know, pesticides on it, I guess. Mm. I'm a little, kind of, I guess, nervous and anxious and, uh, I don't know how I'm going to handle this, but um, I have to fly um, and travel for work on Friday. Like, early Friday morning, I have a um, 7 o'clock flight um, on Friday. <laughs> so, I'm a little nervous about um, basically finding good options to eat. Um, obviously, you can't prep when you travel. Um, you can't. Sorry I'm bouncing a lot because this car, <laughs> this car like, does not have shots. And that's so much for Steve. And let's get over it. Um, <laughs> All right, thank you, Miss Ann. Uh, yeah. Tommy, Got my hydraulics. Let's this give a, a quick oh. update on today's <laughs> But yeah. Damn, yeah, we're on a road, like a back road with like a lot of speed bumps. But, um, yeah, so I'm nervous about, um, that I'm going up for work. So they'll probably provide, um, some food for us. Um, because we're going to have, like, this long workshop that's, like, majority of the day. Um, and sorry, I'm still eating my breakfast. Um, and usually when people provide lunch for you, it's, like, just sandwiches. 
bunch of bread <laughs> just to fill you up and keep you going. But I'm like, I don't know the calorie counts. I don't know where the food came from necessarily. Um, there are more than likely be other options like soups and salads, hopefully. Um, but I don't know. And I don't like not knowing. <laughs> So, I'll probably record a little bit of um, my trip on Friday um, and how that goes. But, and I'll probably grab lunch. Apple butter spread. That's what it says. Apple butter. Oh! I need to be a rapper. <laughs> but, um, yeah, it's um, the apple butter spread. So. I'll probably go to like Chop or um, Panera Bread is another good one that I go to often. Um, it's, it's so many options downtown for me to eat and like grab something really quickly and know like what's in my food and um, how many calories are in it. So I'll probably record later when I'm getting lunch. But yeah. Oh, I lied. I lied. Um, <laughs> I do feel my hamstrings a little bit from that workout yesterday and um, as well as my shoulders and a little bit of my abs but I think my abs are from are, are a little sore from butts and guts instead of what Jillian put me through yesterday so yeah um, I'm gonna make my own salad I'm back in the office and we're spraying like crap <laughs> even though my door was closed um, I ended up getting um, a steak salad with um, it, it, this one usually comes with like fried onions but I ended up opting for scallions instead um, and I got some egg whites there's some goat cheese in there um, and what else did I get? It's like a lot going on there. Tomatoes. Um, and I topped it off with some um, Greek yogurt dressing. It's like a, um, a Greek style yogurt too. What is that? Uh, just, I can never say it right. But um, Tassini or something. It's usually in Greek food. But, um, and of course salt and pepper and a little bit of water. freaking starving. <laughs> I couldn't take it anywhere, like I had to grab something, so I'm in Walgreens right now that's down the street from my job. Super good here. So, help me, can't hear me over this vacuum in the back, but um, I'm going to head to the gym soon. Um, hopefully I can record um, some of the workout at the gym. Um, but I'm wearing the Breathe In tank that I got from Walmart. And just, uh, I'm going to wear some shoes to match this bra color, but yeah. <laughs> um, I didn't expect these leggings to fit this well, but they're like a large and I thought I would need like an extra large for the bottom um but yeah they're gray and well dark and light gray striped and mixed print and i'm gonna wear like some gray tennis shoes with it Ugh. <laughs> but yeah so okay <laughs> so i will see you at the gym or, or after the gym, either one.
parts of the workout is <coughs> I'm like choking in shiz <laughs> right now but um oh my god the guy that was um you didn't have to really turn it down all the way but the guy that was teaching the class I'm just trying to catch my breath and get my bearings together um his name is Delancey and um me and one of my friends used to go to him to kind of like do individual training and everything and um he's intense you just will not come out of the class without being sore um but yeah i only caught about 20 minutes or the first 20 minutes of the class but it's an hour long and he i uh, just i have no words i have no words <laughs> for the ooh, yeah, hiccups and everything but the type of training he does is intense, intense cardio hit. But then he also, um, which you guys didn't get the chance to catch. Um, oh, my battery. But um, he does um, weights along with the cardio. So we're headed off to the grocery store. Um, and I'm going to cook some dinner um, tonight. Uh, so I can have it and everything for... Um, tomorrow and everything um for dinner and possibly lunch i don't know if i'm gonna have lunch with my co-workers or not because we have a long middle of the day lunch meeting so i will try to show you guys um what i'm getting at the grocery store if not i'll show you how and what i'm prepping for my meal um but not even necessarily prepping just cooking ahead of time um yeah tico's being a brat right now <laughs> a major brat but um oh another thing um i did speak with him about um training with him again and he doesn't do um basically the days that i would like him to do <laughs> which were like tuesdays and thursdays something like that um he does mondays and saturdays now so i may go to him um to train on Saturdays because I mean I really have nothing else to do workout wise but a DVD so I might as well um, and I'll probably get him to record um, just how intense his workout is uh, when you do individual training with him so see you at the grocery store
They have nan crisps. Crisps now. Like in different flavors. You don't know nan. <laughs> I'm like debating on trying these and they look. And garlic parmesan. Do you want the garlic parmesan? What are the ingredients? Enriched white flour. That's the first one. Okay, so this is the finished result of the stir fry. It's a lot of stir fry for the calories. And I still, um, I don't know if you can see on my plate, but I added some of my leftover brown rice there. Um, and hubby is heating up some basmati rice to go with it. And I'm curious to see what that tastes like. I've never tasted it before. Um, so you saw me cutting up the um, chicken in the beef and all the ingredients in the beginning um, so I added this and as you can see no high fructose corn syrup um, and this is just basically teriyaki teriyaki sauce and I also added a sesame ginger um, dressing this is a light kind and I'm sure this doesn't have any um, high fructose corn syrup there um, has lower sugars and stuff too um so this is about 300 calories worth of just the stir fry so i am probably gonna call it a night um i still have more water to drink <laughs> this is still from gym class and i'm like surprised i haven't guzzled the heck out of this yet because i'm still a little thirsty but um yeah so um See you guys in the morning. Um, and yeah.